Hello, board members. How are we doing this fine, fine uh, Tuesday afternoon? Well, I hope. We have to uh, get a little bit more time in, in uh, Underrail, where we have finally visited what I think is the topmost floor and walking around a little bit, and we ended up killing Gubbins and his, his pack of bandits. What else did we do? Oh, the Freak Tunnel. That's what it was. Yes, we met the Freak, who was a... I don't know, a scientist of some kind. And they sent us on a quest to some of their old houses to acquire gear so that they make it a, a tool for us to access some of their other hidden houses. In the process, we found um, the, what do you call them? The acid, uh, what was it? Acid hunters or acid? Yeah, the acid hunters or whatever, we found out that they were kind of squatting in one of his old houses because they had ties to one another. That uh, we talked to them and we had the option of killing them, but we decided to let them go just to see what would happen. Dogbiter gave in to the drama on that one just to see what was going to happen. In the middle compartment, there's nothing inside. Pudge. Now, this is exactly what we needed our new object for. In the form of this thing. Um, I'm curious to see how this is going to work. We're getting right into it. It is audio based, so I'm going to turn up my audio a little bit. Let's see what happens, team. Let's, let's see what happens. Okay, plug in the orange box. Orange box. Okay, the orange box signals that it's working. The buttons glow in red color. Perception. If the sounds could be qual quantified, whereby the sounds are numbers in no particular order in regards to the buttons on the phone's interface, the sequence would read 32342. Two. Oh my god, do I have a high enough perception that it just lets me solve the puzzle? What? Is that an option? Seriously? I would have never guessed that I could just solve the puzzle. That's amazing. There, okay, let's try it. So, let's see. So, let me read it. So, wait, 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 wait. Play the sequence again. The sequence would read three, two, three, four, two. Sound uh, numbers in no particular order in regard to the button's phone interface. The sequence would read, we'll try directly what it says, and then we'll try to translate it, but for this being one instead of this being one. So, three, two, three, four, two. Okay. So, I don't think that works. So, we're going to translate it down one, but this is as one. One, two, three, four, five. Three... Four, five, two? No. So... Test out the buttons on the phone. Oh, okay, I gotcha. So, two, four. I can't tell if this, this doesn't seem like it's working. The sounds could be quantified, whereby the sounds are numbers in no particular order. In regards to the buttons on the phone's interface, the sequence would read 34115. That is not working.
What was that? That was completely a different a different category of noise. Well, someone someone tell me that that was did we have someone come into chat or what? What just happened? Like the guitar squeal was radically different. Okay, wait, wait. So Okay, so it's not Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, hold on. Let me try this again from the top. Plug in. Okay, so it's not telling me that this does this doesn't correspond to the actual numbers. It's just saying that this is one number, this is two the same number repeated, a, th a second number, and then a completely different number. That is weirdly misleading. Also, the guitar rift was in there again, which I'm assuming means it's actually tied into one of the buttons, which is sort of insane. So that was two. What is going on with this um, the guitar rift? Someone is messing with me. What is happening? All right, so Is that just the sound of, like, the music background is just the random electrical guitar? No? Okay, so... Ika, welcome. We are absolutely involved in some kind of musical nightmare. How are you doing? Okay, okay, so... God, this is such the dumbest way I've ever experienced to try to do this. Okay, so... So three is the really high one.
The way I did it was use my phone to record the sounds. Yeah. So now I'm, I'm curious about this. I don't know if you know what this is, but it doesn't seem to be working for me with this. Although on dominating, it's harder like every puzzle, so I don't know if it's easy enough on normal. Right, I gotcha. So it says, perception. If the sounds could be quantified, whereby the sounds are numbers in no particular order in regards to the buttons on the phone's interface, the sequence would read 25135. So this is saying that it's kind of giving me an half an answer, right? Okay, so that was... Okay. So one... I don't know, I've never passed the perception check. See, the other problem with this is the electrical guitar going off in the background for no reason while I'm trying to listen to a bunch of specific sounds. Like, hold on, hold on. Okay, module, you've officially upset me enough. That's, that's just going away now. That's not happening anymore. Okay, wait. I assume two five one three five. Yeah, that's what I thought too. I've tried that also, but that doesn't that doesn't seem to work. Why am I still getting these electrical guitar noises in the background? Is it not? Is it ambient volume? Okay. Am I, am I crazy? Is someone else, are you hearing the electrical guitar riffs in the background while this is going on? Is this part of the interference or something it's talking about? No, see that's not working. Ambient noise, I just turned that all the way off though, didn't I? Yeah, ambient volume is all the way off. Yeah, I don't think these correspond directly to a number. I think what this is is telling me that these are all separate numbers except for this set of num or this this set of sounds are the same. See, that's like a Okay, so the guitar rift is actually part of this sound. 
to cause it to be more difficult to understand. Wow. That is messed up. Okay, okay. Um... Okay, so the rat hound one doesn't even make a noise? No sound, there must be an interference between the phone and the orange box, okay. Oh, okay, so two doesn't even work. Okay, that's like a six. Okay, so it is a six. So it's like six. It's not a six two. This concept of what is happening right now is a nightmare. It, it there are literal people I believe who have nightmares about this very thing. Why this was the thought process on how you do sound puzzles? No. I think they, I think that whoever did this, Stidge or whatever their name is, I don't think they understand how other people hear noises. Because not only is this already inherently difficult, matching the tones, that's something a lot of people can't do already. Some of these are pretty bad. Yeah, you're not wrong. Some of them are nightmares. Like, the, the number puzzle for solving, like, the gas thing, that was pretty rough. But technically, that's why I recommend recording it. I guess I'm going to have to? I mean, we've got it down to blue question mark. Maybe maybe that's what it is. I just write it down based off the symbol on it. And I have, like, no, no paper left. Okay, hold on. So... So question mark. Okay. Question mark. Okay, so I think the second one is Red Cross. Yeah. Yeah, Red Cross. So we got blue question mark, Red Cross. Okay. Nope. That's the last one. That's going to be Green Shield.
The way I did it was I played each sound individually and I said like one or two before playing the sound. And I could do the full playback and assign numbers each time to make a code. Right, right. I'm trying to do it without that. I'm trying to do it with just what they're giving me here. I don't have any exclamation points yet. Okay. Question mark. Red cross. So, let me try something. Okay, that's definitely the last tone, for sure. And to be fair, smartphones do exist in the Unreal Universe, so it's something your character could do. Well, that's fair. Yeah. So that's the last one. So that should be two, right? So... Okay, I think that's going to be a, a blue question mark. Wait, wait, wait. So blue. So I think I got the second one wrong. I don't think the second one is Red Cross. Okay, so I think I get what's going on. I think... Hold on. Okay, so I think one is the red rat hound button. Three of these sequences in a row on each phone. Oh, it's three. Okay, so that was part of my problem. Maybe I was getting it right then. Okay, hold on. So let, let me try this one and see what happens. Let me see what happens first. So blue question mark. Red cross. It worked. I think we got it, actually. Okay, okay, we got it. That was one, and they didn't give me the buzz that we were wrong. So we got the first one. We got the first one. Okay, let me translate these to numbers, then. Two, five, four, one. Okay. You got one of three. Right. Right, 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 right. Okay, okay, okay.
one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so there is a one-to-one -one translation in here. And in the right order, right? Uh, yellow. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. So let me see. Okay, I think yellow wrench is going to be first. Yeah, yellow wrench is first, so four. Okay, then I think it's one. Yeah. Six. Okay, so I think we got four, one, six. Then I think three, four, one, six, three. Okay, so we're close. We got four, one, six, three right now. It almost sounds like one again but the perception check is telling me that's not the case let me try it one more time that might be the two that we can't get a sample of Okay, that's different. I think that's going to be two. So I think the last one is two then. Let me try it one more time with with six maybe at the end. Well, no, we got another six, so it's different. All right, so it's got to be two then. So we've got, we got four. One, two, three, four. Yellow wrench. Yeah, okay, so we just gotta roll it up one, basically. So, four. Six is blue question mark. Three. Green shield. And then the red rat hound button. Oh, that's two. Okay, we got two. We got two. All right, four, two. Okay, four, two, four, one, six. Okay, we're getting there. We're making progress, team. All right. Okay, I think that's three. Three, 
three, three. That last one sounds like five. Okay, okay. So three something, three something, five. And these two numbers won't match. They're two different numbers. It might be one. Yeah, okay. So it might be one. Three, one, three, maybe. Let's try that. Okay, three, one, three, and then I think two. Let's try it again one more time, and I think we got it. That that one almost sounds like a one. Let's I'm gonna try putting a one in there. So three one three one five. Even though our perception is telling us otherwise, just in case. Otherwise it's gonna be three one three two five is what we're looking for. Okay, I think it's two. It sounds different than one, just a little bit. Okay, so we got three, one, three. So green shield, red cross. Rat hound. Yeah, yeah. And then five is red exclamation point. The button on the orange box low in dim white color. The color slowly fades out, but the device turns off. A moment later, the nearby metal door unlocks! Let's go! Disconnect the orange box and leave. Give me that secret passage! With a murder bot in it? What the... Okay, I didn't expect the murder bot. Heavily damaged machine. We did it, Patrick! We saved the city! Yeah, we did, SpongeBob. All right, give me that gasoline. Okay, give me the box. Laser gun. Computer rack. We stole a bunch of, we store a bunch of random computer parts inside of the computer rack, sure. What do we got? Blueprint jumping bean pill, okay. Trance, puts, puts the consumer in a state of psionic super emission. Increases critical damage bonus to psi abilities by 100% and psi cost by 20%. Interesting. Take all that. Let me turn the audio back up since it didn't matter either way. Something like that, I think. Let me know if that's too loud or not loud enough. Um, padding? Wow, 114 quality padding. Never going to be able to use that with this character. Hey, more gasoline and some coal. Handmade remote control. A repurposed remote controller now featuring a set of controls and connectors suitable for electronic devices. I'm assuming that's the item we need for him specifically. Okay, I left some stuff in here. Or I'm going to leave some stuff in here, I should say. Uh, just because, I mean... As is tradition, I'm carrying around far too much loot to be even remotely reasonable. Uh, okay. Probably just leave basically all this stuff here for now. I don't think I need... Oh, I can take that Molotov with me. Oh, yeah, and I forgot about this guy's special hammer. This guy has a special hammer, everybody. 
Look at how silly he is with his special hammer. Uh, we'll take the Molotov and put that in our belt. Um, I don't think there's anything else I really need to store here. Use these. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the camera jammer. Remotely overloads the camera's scanning eye, increasing the effective scanning time by 82%. Increases with hacking skill, which makes the camera slower to find and report intruders. So I guess it just means it'll give me a little bit of a temporarily stun on cameras to let me sneak by them? Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Well, we did it, team. I hope to God that stays open forever. We never have to do it again. They take longer to recognize you, basically. Right, right. Well, that would give us time to sneak by since cameras have perfect vision. We can't stealth by them, so. What am I using right now? 95%. Okay. I don't know what the chances are of running into muggers is, so. Just taking it a little slow, team. We're just taking it a little slow. Oh, like that. Like that right there. We got a beetle brainer. I don't know what that means. Lunatic scanner, lunatic nuker, and a lunatic psychopath. Okay. That seems like a lot to try to fight right now. This looks like a random encounter. Yeah, the 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 beetle. What is it? The beetle miner. The beetle brainer seems pretty random. You're not wrong. It looks like they're wearing armor made out of beetles, so that's fun. Oh, there's another emergency phone. Now the question becomes: Is that far enough away that if I come out of stealth, they're not going to insta kill me? Because that's a lot of enemies. I can barely see that Luna take a nuker. But luckily, from here, they would have to run all the way down here. So this is almost optimal for me trying to, like, shoot and move. Also, it looks like they'd have to go this way to get to me. Hold on. Let me make sure there's no, like, backup over here. Just a bunch of bottles. Hacking. We can do that. Ooh. Oh, that's actually a nice little submachine gun. Color me surprised. Barricaded from the other side. That's pretty hard to do with a trapdoor that lifts up. I guess you'd have to, like, shove something into it in just the right kind of way. Just checking to make sure there isn't any kind of like secret items hidden in anything. Okay, they they can't seem to see me. Up in the metal compartment. There's nothing inside. Okay. Okay. So we have another one here? Oh, I wonder if this is gonna open the trap door for us. Oh, I almost forgot. Okay. Nick's station. Oh, there's another sign back here. Keep out. <laughs> okay. I looked at the free drones quest. The only quest affected by the spy is the last free drones mission. So if we don't catch the spy by the last mission, something bad's going to happen? Is that what you mean? Or the concept of the spy only affects the last one and doesn't affect anything else? Why are there so many stupid buttons? The former. Okay, so if we don't catch the spy by the time we do the last drone mission, something bad will happen. Okay. That we can do. That just means we need to start breaking into all the protectorate bases and looking for all their secret files. And that means we need to start shooting protectorates. Potentially. Okay, um, let's see. Okay, this one's actually going to be pretty easy since it reuses two tones. 
And there's only one random solo tone. Okay, okay. I don't remember how many of these I need to open, but I guess I'll just open them all eventually. Three, and then two. Okay. Try out the phone. Okay. okay, so the red cross doesn't work. We start off by talking to most of the drones and asking them about the missing leader. Okay. Probably won't get to that this stream, but... Maybe Saturday we can do that. So it's either going to be one or it's going to be two. Okay, I think it's one, two, two, one. It's going to be a little hard because we can't test the two or the ones, but. Okay. Okay, I think that's four. So one, two, two, four, one. Okay, yeah, four, okay, we got it. So four. Okay, so one, two, two, four, one. So one. Wait, what? Oh, there was already a number put in there. Oh, okay, never mind. I don't know. Apparently, we we accidentally put a number in. Try out the button on the. Okay, okay, wait, wait. Disconnect, and we'll start over. Hold on. Okay. Nothing in there. It's fine. It's not what we're worried about. In the orange box. No, no, no. no. Uh, okay. I want I want a better number. Since these are randomly generated, I want something that's like two, 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 three, three, or something, right? Like that. That's not too bad. Okay, so this one didn't work out. Four, two, five, four, four. Okay, so I think that's going to be three something something three three. Okay, yeah. So three something something three three. God, those those interludes with the guitar are insane. Okay, so I think two is gonna be one then. And six.
six, not five. Six. Six. I think this is gonna be six. Play the same. Oh, three. Three. Okay. All right. So, what we gotta figure out is the two. The two is either two or it's one. So three something. Okay, so it's two is actually two. All right, so it's going to be green shield, red rat hound. Okay, green shield. Red rat hound. Six is blue question mark. And then it should be back to green shield twice. Darn it. I mean, this is only two tones, so this is a really good one. This is a really good one. One, four. I mean, if we can figure out the first two, we've got it. One, okay. So it should be two, and I think, I think six. I think it's two and six. Okay, no, two and five, I think. Okay, two and three. All right. Welcome, T12. We're trying to do a sound puzzle while they play guitar riffs over the top of it for no reason. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. For no reason. Da -da -da -da. But welcome, T12, as we attempt to do stupid puzzles. All right, so two, three, two, three, two. All right, let's try this again. Yeah, two, three, two, three, two. All right, let's try this. So we go back. So two rat hound and three is green. So rat hound, okay, so three, four, three. Okay, we got that one. That one was good, we got that one. I think that first one I messed up on was I think it was one and not two in that in that combination. Should it should have been three, one, six, three, three. All right, one, four, four, six, two. Not the best, but here we go. Let me. One, four, four, six, two. And how you doing, T12? Hopefully you're having a nice Tuesday. Okay, so I think that's going to be either two or one, three, three, and then I don't know. Okay, so two is one, 
So that means the first one's probably two. So two. Yeah, I think two, three, three. Three, three, five, one. Yeah, okay, two, three, three, five, one. So two, Rat Hound, Green Shield, Green Shield. Rat Hound, Green Shield, Green Shield. Red exclamation points. And then Red Cross. Bam! All okay, right, that's two. One more of this. One more. Oh, my God. Oh, I oh, almost hit a button. This is such a pain in the butt because I don't have room to, like... The way this setup is, I cannot be, like, jumping around a lot. Like, it's meant to be the wasp wasp, or, or, or with a controller. Having to, like, write, I'm like, it's not meant for this at all. Like, not even a little bit. Two, two, six, three, five. <sighs> like my arm, my shoulder is starting to hurt from this right now. Okay, so I think that was one, one. Okay, one, one. One, one, I think. Five? One, one, five? Five. I think that last one's six. Listen to how long that guitar solo goes on. There is no reason for that at all. One, one, five. Yeah. Four, I think? One, one, five, four, six. One, five, four, six. So Red Cross, Red Cross. Five is exclamation point. Four is yellow wrench. And six should be blue question mark. Uh, white, then it size up before the turn's off. Just Slades out before the device turns off. Okay. Gained feet fine tuned. Wait, there's a feet tied to this? Wait, what does that do? What did I just get? Wait, fine tuned. You're starting to develop an ear for subtle differences in, a, in sound. In a world comprised largely of dark caves and metro tunnels, this is no small boon. Detection is increased by 15%. This feat was acquired outside leveling. Wow. Okay, so is that all we got, or did we actually unlock this this door? That's all we got was just the feet? Oh, man. 
I mean, a 15% in increase in detection is nice. I was expecting something a little bit more um, advantageous, though. Not all the phones are tied to hideouts. That's unfortunate. I hear a dog. That's probably also unfortunate. Like, this is honest to God just a straight up metro station. Like, this is just a train station. The ones he sends you to specifically are, though. Oh, okay. Okay. Character is an idiot. Got it. Confirmed. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for that. Hey, I'll use that health hypo right now. Old Metro ticket. Well, at least we got some experience from it. <sighs> All right. Well, that happened. Oh yeah, there's this whole band of, of people over here. Okay, so it looks like their only way through is right here. So... Let me see. So how do I want to do this? I think, will they see this? Okay, no one's coming over here. Too bad this spot is well lit. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Okay, so they, they didn't see that. So then, wait, I can put a mine down on top of a bear trap? How does that work? Okay. No? Oh, okay. Well, it's weird that it let me, but. If you, if you try one of the traps will go off on you. I think the bear trap? Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay. So this team is in for a bit of a problem. I don't have much of a field of view. The line of sight in this is completely whacked out. It's just, it's terrible. <sighs> okay, how do I want to do this then? I do have some basic cheap grenades on me. Can you hit one of from the doorway into the trap? I think so. Or two, mark threes, HE threes. I'm not gonna need this. I'm probably gonna want to bring. Range weapon increased by twenty five percent. I'm probably gonna want to use this instead. Yeah, frag's gonna be better. Into the shop? Yeah, yeah. I don't. I, I maybe. Problem is, is, since these are all psionic people, I don't know if my shield's gonna help much. I can shoot one of them. Yes. I can't, I can't in fact take out this nuker, which is probably pretty good. Just wondering if there's some place. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Okay, I can see two from here. Or not, actually. <laughs> I can't actually see two people from there. Okay, wait, I can maybe see two from here. Because I want to use, like, we want to use Shooting Spree, we're going to want to use Snipe, and we're going to want to use Aim Shot, and then whatever other shots we can get off before time runs out, right? Before we run out of action points? Okay, so. I can shoot him. I can shoot him. Can't shoot her, or it. I don't know what this is. So this might be my best bet. 
It just sucks that snipe has to be done from stealth, right? Cannot critically hit. Man, that really sucks. They really like the mind shroom. Yeah, they do. Mind shrooms and uh, the beetle brainer here with the with the beetle armor. Okay. All right. So let's give her a shot, team. Let's give her a shot and see what happens, shall we? We'll probably die violently, but we're going to go out in a blaze of glory. Hold on, everyone. So we do this. Activate snipe on probably the nuker. Okay. Then we hit you with this. That almost killed you. Got the points back. Can shoot this one also. And then probably make a break for it with what's left of our movement. Go into the shop now? Yeah, I guess we can. Or do you still have AP? I still have action points left. That was all, most of that was refunded. And we got more points back from our gun. So we have enough for another shot. Can I take the shot from back here? I can. Okay. Critical hit. Killed. Okay. Okay. And we make a break for it. In the turn. Okay. That seemed to have worked. Yes. <laughs> what is this? I don't even know what this is. That looks terrible, though. What is this guy? He's got ghosts. He has ghosts. What is happening? Okay, so we take out this guy first, I think. Or not. Or not. Okay, or not, apparently. They're protecting from physical attacks. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So how do I get rid of them? Okay, so the explosions will probably kill him in a second. Each shot they absorb gets rid of one. Oh, okay. Man, he's got a lot of those. I'm almost out of ammo. Good lord, how many of these things does he got? Okay, we really want the explosion to kill that guy. Okay, he's got one ghost left, it looks like. And you use your shooty feet on him? Yeah, that's a good idea. Wow, you are alive somehow. What? How is that possible? How is, how is this possible? I don't have enough points for rapid fire. Are you kidding? Close the door. Uh, I don't have enough points now. <sighs> okay. And I don't, whoop. I don't have enough <laughs> for anything else. Oh, this is always gonna be interesting. Wow, the one hit point, though. No, I was saying close it to get away from the clone. Oh, that's what you meant. Ah, we're just dead. Psionics, everyone! It's not busted at all. Nope. Nothing busted about psionics around here. 
Completely legitimate stratagems. And what happens if I put one here? Will they see this? No. Okay, great. Next time, just brush your pistol to get rid of the Shadow Clone Jutsu? Yeah, seriously. I really thought these mines would do more damage, but apparently they didn't care. Oh, there's my burst attack. Okay. Uh, damage a special range weapon attack increase by. Okay. Yeah, they didn't care. Let's hope this next one goes as goes as well. Low level mines are pretty meh. Uh, well, I can't use high level mines because of reasons. Okay. Wait, if I'm here, can I shoot three people? No, I can't even see them. What? I never understand this module's concepts of combat. Do this. Do this, we shoot you, you go down, we shoot you, you don't die. Uh, try the second one, and nope. Um, got some action points back though, got some action points back. Enough to get around the corner. Ghosts. Oh, you're an ice guy, okay. I don't know what you do, lady. Or person, I guess. Okay, that's fine. Oh, you can see me from that angle. Well, that's odd. I have to go all the way there to be able to shoot you? What? So what does this stasis thing do? What does this do? <laughs> My best not to shoot the guy in the bear trap until they burn, burn another turn. Yeah, yeah. Uh, ice shield? Let's just eat bullets also. Oh, no, no, not that. I want to throw a grenade. You can Molotov them? I guess that's true. We could Molotov. I don't know what that's going to do, but... Well, he's burning, so that worked, I guess. Uh huh. He's burning and he's panicked. Yeah, that is nice. I don't know. Oh, you ran all the way up there to do that. How odd of you. I don't know why you did this thing. I don't know why you have done this thing that you have done. Uh, huh. Okay, I'll just, I'm gonna play it safe. Something happened. Okay. Something happened there, I don't know what it was. Oh, he's way down here now. He's way over there now, team. He's way over there. Okay. I'm going to shoot you. Please die. Thank you. Don't kill me! I'm important! You can right click properties to see their statuses. Oh, will that show that too? Uh, where did he go? Um, I have become concerned. Okay, I heard him. Um, he went the other way around. Oh. 
What? Go inside and close the door? Okay. I don't know if there's another way around. No, activate combat! Son of a... Baskets! Well, I get stealth. Okay, let's try this. Okay, we got snipe off. We just got into combat. Just barely got into combat, team. Oh my god. Alright. Well, thanks for all the stuff, t everyone. Oh, a Psy Beetle brain in a jar. A Psy Beetle Brain suspended in liquid and connected to some sort of electronic device. Invoke a random Psy ability on, on yourself or another. Consumes 25 energy. Huh. The subway potentially, depending on if it's an actual loading zone or not. Oh, okay. Huh. What a bizarre thing this is. So, <laughs> does this let me invoke it even if I don't have Psy training? Can I just put this in, like, my pistol slot and just randomly be throwing, take it, save it, and use it immediately on yourself? Yes? Okay, gotcha. Huh. Alright, well, that happened. Wow, you've got a lot of stuff considering you're a Psy person. 78, I think that's almost as good as ours. Huh. Okay. And one mind shroom to wash it all down with, you see. It's magic? Yeah, it's definitely magic. Huh. Okay. Well, that's cool. 2939. 50. 19 and 85 is almost a sniper rifle's equivalent of damage. I guess the only problem is it's a 32 AP. Uh, 78. Yeah, ours is 85, so ours is better. Um, I do need to fix my weapon, though. Where is my advanced mechanical repair kits? We put some... We put some work into this gun. This gun's been busy. Dang. Your gun is damaged? Yes. Yes, it is. We, it's been busy, alright? We've put a lot of, wor of bullets through this gun. Okay, what do I got? So perception plus one or detection. We'll go back to that. Uh, I won't unload these guns because then they're just going to weigh more than they currently do, which we don't really want. I am going to throw a cheap grenade, though, at this so I can get the XP out of there. Okay, so. Uh, I'm going to do this in combat. Otherwise, my character will do super stupid, stupid, stupid things. There we go. Oh, there was still acid in here, apparently. Well, that's fun. But we want that XP, team. It's pretty rare we get XP these days, so we want it when we can get it. Um... Oh, we're maxed out on level 3 HE grenades. Fun. Alright, well that was a fun little fight. Make a save, and I want to see the magic brain in a jar. Oh, okay, yes. Uh, jar brain. Alright. Now what do I do with this thing? Wait, is it a plot item? It's a plot item? Oh, it goes in a utility slot. It's combat utility and it's a plot item. What? Okay. I just chilled myself. Okay. Okay. So does it take batteries? <laughs> I just hit myself with lightning. 
Batteries, yes. Wow, okay. Stun myself again. Okay. Oh, temporal distortion. What is there? Ow. Okay. So it seems like this is primarily offensive magic. Oh, I lit myself on fire. Oh, I'm actively a fire monster. Well, look at that, team. That was fun. A few of these are good side moves to cast on yourself. Here's one. Yeah, we turned ourselves into a fire monster. Oh, we froze ourselves. I don't know what that's going to do. Okay. Okay, it's out of batteries now. All right, well, that's fun. That's fun, isn't it? Huh. Okay. I mean, we'll hang on to that. That could be something. Someday, that might be something, team. Maybe not right now, but someday. Ooh, 4.30. That's the perfect time. That's the perfect time to actually wrap it up, too. We'll just leave it there. We'll, leave it, we'll save it with the uh, magic jar brain. We could just save it there. I feel like that could be used for funny exploits. Eventually, yeah. That's really interesting. That's really, 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 really interesting, actually. Okay. Okay, perfect. There we go, team. We we solved some puzzles. We got a new feat that gives me 15% more perception. Uh, or increases our perception by 15%. I, however, that ends up working out. And we got one of the pieces for our quests. And then we found a brain in a jar that has magical wizard powers. So that was a pretty productive little stream right there for that. Because I wonder if it counts as you actually casting the spells. And maybe you could do something like cast fireball on yourself. And kill an N NPC nearby? <laughs> oh, man. At that point, I'm just basically dropping your grenade at my own feet. I'm doing the kamikaze move of just like... Oh! I take reduced explosion damage, so I just constantly drop grenades at my own feet. All the lurkers, of course, thank you. You have the Twitch world go around. We always appreciate you. Anybody that checks the VODs here on Twitch or checks the VODs on the YouTube repository, thank you. It's always greatly appreciated. Seeing those numbers helps keep me motivated. If you need a well-thought-out solution, you need a thinking solution. Raven Hilbrick Inc., Thinking Solutions. Uh, I hope to see you all back, and I hope you're having a good whatever you're up to. Uh, but yeah, that'll be it. And yeah. Yeah. Bye!